anyone just walking past the street see the hotel there hotel 91 oh wait now I can get past it. <laughs> hang on aye anyone just walking past you may think oh that's just the hotel just what you can see but it's not I'll show you good talking to you aye uh, thank you that's me, really channel. This video will go on. I'll put it on next week. Okay. It'll be the um, Hotel 91 tour. That's what the video will be called. Yes. That's the channel name there. Steve, Steve Taylor. Steve Taylor, my New York City. That's okay. the video. That's the channel, you know. Okay. Okay. Yeah, if I need anything, your expertise, I you know, text you. Aye, aye. It'll be on next what week. You, what, you, what, what you do for a living? Making those uh, YouTube? No, no, I work in a hospital back in England. Oh. I'm a porter in a hospital. I just come on vacation, you know. Okay. And when I'm here, I make loads of videos for my YouTube channel. Okay. Yeah. Because I love, I love it, yeah, you know. Yeah, so I put loads you, of videos you, on, you yeah. know. I, I tell my. Aye, my tell friend. your friend. Aye, I'll put no, it on. No, the hotel, the aye, aye. Right. Give her one mate, of them as well if you like. Mate, mate, mate I say, I'll, you know, he make a YouTube. Yeah, yeah. Job, It'll be on next that. week. Okay. Okay. What can he fella? Just starting him before. Turns out his friend uh, actually owns a hotel. Anyway, this is just this is just the front of the hotel. Oh, those are stretches. Ah, oh, get out with the road. The stretches, sort of around the back of these buildings, then way back onto the next street down. So it's sort of it's up, it's across here. My room actually backs. Backs, my window looks right onto the Manhattan Bridge again this time. So it sort of goes behind these other buildings and back. I'll show you a little bit when I get around the corner. So it's the front of it there. Obviously, here's the Manhattan Bridge here. And on the Manhattan Bridge video I did last October, I did stand up on there and showed you a bit of the side of the hotel. I don't know. I don't think I'd get a very good view from around here, like. But this, this here is also it. This is also. Okay, this is what comes down the back and down the side. And there's a, there is a, like a, an entrance on the back as well. But that, that door's not always open. So I won't try using that one right now. I'll just go in the main entrance. Just before I go in, this is the uh, Zing Wong Barbecue Inc. The Chinese restaurant. It's right next door to the hotel. It's lovely in here, like really, really nice. I'll definitely be going back in here for uh, supper, tea, whatever. But anyway, this is the hotel here. Corridor when you first got in, you've got to go to the second floor reception. Hello there. Hello. It's like a nice marble floored um, corridor. There's never anything in these windows. And he's thought it was like display out. A staircase there, but I'll show you that later. Generally in a hotel you'd expect a reception desk to be kind of here when you first come in, but nah. It actually tells you, I've got signs saying, use the elevator to check in on the second floor. And the elevator's just here. In use, of course. It's nice, like, even this area is nice and clean. That's the back entrance, the back door, but quite often it's locked. I've got out there once before. There it is. Hello there. Hey. Right, what I'll do, I'll just go, I'll go to the second floor first. I'll show you the reception. Shut the door. Don't move it. Wait, that part of it anyway. And there's cameras everywhere. Scattered all the hotel. 
they've got all the corridors and everything's out, they've got cameras on. This is the reception area. Yeah. Hello there. Hello. You alright, man? I'm in, I'm still on the third floor. I'm just doing a quick video for YouTube if you don't mind. Okay, that's fine. Just show it around that. So this is um, the second floor. And what you've got here, you make a, look like coffee making facilities and that. That's free, that's all free, like. This is kind of a lounge area when you're leaving. They've got a room just down there. You can leave your bags and that in if you like. And if you get a taxi from here, you can just sit about here and wait. They'll just let you hang about. It comes in that. Uh, vending machine. It's good value actually. It's only a dollar for uh, anything out of it. That's pretty much it for uh, the second floor. I know always the ice cold and all the drinks they get out of them are really nice and cold. Lush, like. Let pop up to the fourth floor. Fourth floor. Again, there's bullets on here. Is um, like the corridors leading the rooms. But also these two other vending machines. Snack one there. The drinks there. Again, it's a dollar for like a can of can of whatever you want or a bottle. Really, really cold stuff. Don't know how much. Uh, oh, there. Pack of the crisps, seventy-five cents. The Jarvis thing is one twenty-five for the top row there. Have a dollar for chocolate bars. But you know, if you're stuck and it's late on at night and you don't want to go out wandering looking for something, it's handy as out. I'm not sure if these ones at the top here are a, a dollar like, hang on, what is it? Here's six. Two dollars. Two dollars for the energy drinks. But everything else is a dollar. Ice machine. It always comes in handy. I'll just pop up now to the sixth floor and show you something else. Hiya! My mistake, it wasn't six, sorry, seven. My first room was along there actually, that corridor there. Hello there, you alright? So along here, we've got a little laundry room. Um, two washers. Was it um, three dollars twenty-five or three? Is it? Oh, three dollars twenty-five for super cycle. I think it was just three dollars for like a two or three dollars for like a quick wash and a little dryer there. One dollar twenty-five gets you. I think it's a twenty-two minutes, twenty-six minutes, something like that. And uh, so you can get your like washing powder and stuff. Oh, there you go. Regular wash, 27 minutes for three dollars. Super wash, 3.25. Dryers, oh, 36 minutes for 1.50. And detergent and softener. It was a handy little room. It certainly was last year after I'd been to that, um, the Jets game at the MetLife Stadium. <gasps> I, uh, I was like a drone rat. I'll get the lift doing the third. I'll, qu I'll give you a quick um, room tour. It's a uh, electronic keys you've got. Christ, dog. Christ, it's dog. As you can see, you can't really see much out the windows, but that's the Manhattan Bridge. Right there. And the other view just looks down, and that's the street I was on just before when I was pointing up to the hotel. 
I'm going to put the light on. I'm going to put a light on here. But uh, there's basically it. I'll come in again in the door. Bathroom is just here. Lovely like. It's a shower bath combination. But this is the big, big difference between this hotel and a lot of others. It's down here in Chinatown. You've got your own bathroom. So this is it. This is there. Uh, you've got like quart hanger thing there, little table. So everything gets charged at night. Telly. A bed. And that's it. It's really comfortable, yeah. Can you hear that? Hang on, let's all shut up. Don't know how well that might come across on the audio, but uh, that's because the sound of the subway is going across on the Manhattan Bridge. But you know how loud it is when I'm outside. So it, that is not really. You don't even hear it really when you're going to sleep in that. But this is it. This is my room. It's lush like. Right, get over here. So I'm just on the third floor now. Obviously, you can use the lift. You get back downstairs if you want. But the staircase here. Sometimes just as quick using this. Yeah, no. There's another staircase you can use. The, like if I'd used this one further along upstairs, it would have taken us out the corridor on the other side of there and so instead of coming out the main door there's a little fire like a fire exit door it's next door brings out there instead but listen to this noise when i come out of here the subway gone past see the noise of that compared to what you hear in the room completely different that's the other door you want to call to come out if i come down near that staircase but that's it that's the hotel 91 And uh, that's why I keep coming back to it. I love that place. So uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching that video. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope it encourages you to come and stay here. It's got a great part in all of Chinatown, you know. And obviously you've got the the noise on the Manhattan Bridge, but it doesn't matter, man. It's just part of being in New York, you know. The noise and the hustle and the bustle. Fantastic. Thanks for watching.